Hello everyone, welcome to ABC Tutorial and thanks for watching the video. This is part number 20 of Point of Cell. So in this part I will solve some problem actually in previous part and few of previous part we were facing some problem uh, with the angular js angular js loading and angular js uh, drop down things so uh, actually for first uh, so I'm just moving to uh, visual studio and uh, uh, solving the problem so what was the problem if I show you first see if i click on the edit it's not loading right it's not loading actually in background id is set but uh, this is not uh, this is not selecting here okay so uh, this is one problem another problem was uh, it's not well it was not loading so actually it's now automatically when the page is loading it's loading uh, uh, by own self so that means how we did it Firstly, it we we fixed it uh, by using uh, success uh, then using then instead of success, right? So if you see on our previous video, we everywhere we use success uh, then then instead of success, right? So we fixed it using this. So uh, now, uh, so. In that case, we have another things, and we, I, I I added some code. The code is previously inside the app.js. We we were just this two line of code, but now I add this code. Uh, one app factory, another app factory, app, app cache, and another is focus. So you can add this to uh, app factory then this is you just you will just copy and paste this uh, using download my project or you can uh, uh, you can watch my article in my website so this is one so another i will see here the angular js version angular js version is 1.8.2 right so in 1.8.2 uh, actually uh, it's not a few things are not compatible with this okay in 1.8.2 but one of my another project actually my angular js was 1.2.2 okay 1.2.2 so in this version in this version everything is working very nice and fine okay so actually what i will do i will just use this version 1.2 Okay, so I will just copy this angular just version. I will just copy this three line, or even I can copy this one line, no problem. One or two line, just I mean, oh, sorry, two file, not line, two file. So if I go and where is my angular js file this is my angular js file i will just replace just i will paste here and replace file so now if i this is my project point of cell so if i go here see this is 1.2.20 right so now i will I will never do anything okay so just I will reload the page I will reload the page and I will just see I will I will just click here it's not working even now okay so I will if I click now still it's not loading I click now still it's not loading okay so I will copy another file copy and I will paste paste here okay 
So if I reload the page, so still it's not coming. If I want to see the version of my JS, still it's 1.8.2. So I have to uh, just uh, So now if I see 1.2, 1.2, so I need to clear the cache. Still it's not working so I will clear the cache so if I log in and if I come here yes now it's 1.2.20 so if I click now see I, I, I never did anything okay so just I change the angular JS file so it's loading here so actually my expectation was this but in 1.8.2 the version is incompatible with other things okay so that's why it's not working see if I click here it's batch 1 is loading and the product name is loading okay so that's the cool things so you can uh, download my project I just replace the Java um, angular chase so from now I will use this 1.2.20 so you you don't have to do anything you just download my latest project then everything will be fine okay so thank you for watching this video keep subscribe and keep watching for the next video thank you